everyone, let's try to evaluate this integral. We want to integrate 3x plus 4 divided by x plus 3. One method that we could use is use polynomial division to simplify the expression. So let's divide x plus 3 into 3x plus 4. So let's try 3 as the first term of the quotient. So 3 times x will be 3x, and 3 times 3 is 9. Then we subtract and we'll get 3x minus 3x, which is 0, and 4 minus 9, which is negative 5. So we could rewrite the problem as 3 minus 5 divided by x plus 3. So let's write that down again. We have 3 minus 5 on x plus 3 dx. So let's integrate each part separately. Let's integrate 3 dx minus 5 times 1 on x plus 3 dx. So the integral of 3 is 3x three minus 5 times the integral of 1 on x plus 3 is natural log x plus 3. And add on our constant of integration, which would be c. And this is our final answer. In this question, we want to evaluate the integral x cubed plus x divided by x plus 1 dx. So let's divide x plus 1 into x cubed plus 0x squared for the missing term and plus x. So the first term of our quotient will be x squared. x squared times x is x cubed. x squared times 1 is x squared. Then subtract. So x cubed minus x cubed is 0. 0 minus x squared will be negative x squared. And bring down our x. So the next term of our quotient is negative x. So negative x times x, negative x squared. Negative x times 1, negative x. And subtract, these will cancel. x minus negative x is 2x. So we can rewrite this as x squared minus x plus 2x, the remainder on the divisor, which is x plus 1. Let's rewrite that over here. We have the integral of x squared minus x plus 2x on x plus 1 dx. So let's try another division on our last expression here. So let's divide x plus 1 into 2x. So that will give us 2. 2 times x is 2x. And 2 times 1 is 2. When we subtract, we have 2x minus 2x, which is 0. And it's actually a 0 we can write there. So 0 minus 2 is negative 2. So we can rewrite this as 2 minus 2 on x plus 1. So let's rewrite the question as x squared minus x plus 2 minus 2 on x plus 1 dx. So let's integrate each part now. x squared is 1 third x cubed minus x is minus a half x squared plus 2 will become 2x minus 2 times the natural log of x plus 1 plus c, our constant of integration. And this is your final answer. Thanks for watching.